It's that time again. It's another Stitch Fix unboxing. I went to go check out. They did it to me. They said, oh, we'll waive your styling fee if you want another one, like a back-to-back -back one. So, of course, I said yes. So, here we have another one. And when I went to go check out, I was going to wait for like a whole nother month because I really don't need clothes. I'm buying so many fall fashion right now because it's just my favorite time of year to buy fashion and I'm seeing so many things on the freestyle. I actually have a freestyle video I'm going to be doing for you guys too because I bought so much from the freestyle as well. But here we are with another Stitch Fix unboxing. And I do have a referral link in the description box if you guys wanna check out Stitch Fix for yourself and you wanna use that referral link, it'll give you $25 off toward your first box, which will cover the styling fee plus some, and then it'll also give me $25 as well. So the first thing you're gonna see in the box is a package that is pre-printed for you to send anything back that you don't want. And then it looks like they have a new style online when you're doing the fixes and things like that. And it also looks like there's only one sheet now. That has the note from your stylist with the prices on here. And then here's the bundle. And they have new packaging on here too. They have a new little logo I noticed online when you're playing the shuffle game and things like that. So here's the bundle. So it looks like some neutrals in this one and I see a green up here at the top. On the style preview, there were two things that I chose to keep and then she did have to substitute the other three. So the first thing I see is this green top from Fortune and Ivy, the Esther button up front knot knit top, dark green size medium. Now I thought I had put in my notes that I didn't care for knotted tops, but I'll have to look back and see because I did think that that was in there. Next up is something from Daniel Rain. So this is something that I did keep from the preview in this navy color. It is the Jetta blouse and in size medium. And then the next thing is this really pretty sweater. It has this open stitch detail on the sleeves from Letty and Me. And it says it's Stitch Fix exclusive. Vittoria pointel sleeve sweater in off white size medium. So we'll see. I hope that's not real fitted because I don't care for fitted sweaters. We'll see. And then this is the other thing that I kept from the preview. It is from Staccata. It's the Giselle V-neck cardigan in light pink size medium. So I thought that looked real pretty and it feels super soft. So I can't wait to try this one. I hope it's not too cropped. It has like a heather look if you can see that. And the last thing is something white from Evolution by Cyrus, the Mina Lightweight Button Sleeve Cardigan in white size medium. So, I do love a good cardigan, so we will see the price on this one, whether this will be a keeper or not. So, let's go ahead and get into the try on. So, here is the first top. Since I didn't have any bottoms, I'm just sticking with my jeans that I had on. And I love the top, the color of it. It's really pretty. It's got a heather look. It's got that diamond sleeve, and it's got some ribbing in it. Now, this is a button up that you could wear by itself or I could open it up and layer a top underneath it. When I took this out of the package, it felt really super soft, but it's a little bit scratchy, especially on my back. It's like real itchy, which I can't have a sweater that's itchy on me. And I'm not sure why, because, well, it's made out of 45% acrylic, 37% polyester and 15% nylon. 3% spandex, so it's got a lot of different materials going through there. Maybe it's the acrylic that's making it real itchy for me. It feels soft though. It feels like it's gonna be a really soft sweater, but I don't know. It's really pretty too. I like the V-neck and I like that it can be versatile where it's buttoned up enough that you could wear it by itself or you can unbutton this and have it as a cardigan, wear it over something else. I love a diamond sleeve. And I like this ribbing detail. So look, it has that really nice ribbing, so I like that too. So this is the Staccata Gazelle V-neck cardigan light pink, $55 for this one. And let's just see what else we got. Okay, so here is top number two, and it's this sweater that I thought would be a little bit form-fitting, and it is a little bit tighter than most sweaters. It doesn't have that loose feel, but the sleeves are gorgeous. Look at that open stitch detail. Absolutely gorgeous sleeves. Not as form-fitting as I thought. So what do you guys think about this one? So I do like this. I think that it's really pretty in the sleeves, and, and I think it's a good length. I would just probably leave it out, I think. So this is the Letty and Me Victoria Pointel Sleeve Sweater, $49 for this one. So here's the navy top. I think this will be a good layering top or I can wear it now, throw a cardigan over it. I'll actually throw that white cardigan that they sent with it over it and see what it looks like. But it has that tear look. So you can see it has that layered look and it's a mixed material. So you've got a more of a stretchy 
knit in the back and then more dressier style polyester in the front. You could layer this under blazers and cardigans. So let me just go ahead and throw that white cardigan on over top of this and let's see how it looks. It's nice and lightweight. So this is not gonna be one of your thick, chunky ones. And I don't like them too long. I don't like a duster style or anything like that. I think she had sent some in the preview that had the duster length. I don't really care for those too much. This one doesn't button, so it's just an open front. No pockets. Does have this little button detail that's right here. So, I mean, this could work. It's one of your lightweight transitioning ones with probably supposed to be like a maybe three-quarter sleeve. The top is the Daniel Rain Jetta Blouse, $58. And this cardigan is Evolution by Cyrus. Mina, lightweight, button, and then it cuts it off. So, I'm not sure what the rest of it is. $65. So I can tell you right now, this cardigan to me is not worth $65. So I don't think I'll be keeping this one because I literally have a tan one and it even comes in the white color. From the Time and True brand at Walmart, that was like $11. And it looks very similar to this one. It actually has slits in the side that makes it a little bit better with some open stitching detail and pockets. So yeah, this is gonna be a pass for $65. Top I like, but I'm not sure if I like it for $58. I do have a lot of the mixed material tops so i have one more top to try on and then i'll just give you my final thoughts okay here's the last item she sent and i would absolutely love this if it didn't have this front tie i don't know there's just something i don't like about a front tie first of all where it lays just throws your eye right there where i don't want anybody looking and i think that if that was just off and it was just a regular blouse that stopped right here it is a little bit longer in the back then I would really like this. This is a really good material too. I like the neckline. I love these button looks, but this color's great too. But yeah, this tie, I just, I, I can't do the ties. So this one, unfortunately, is gonna have to go back too. So let's go ahead and talk about this top. So this is from Fortune and Ivy, which I buy a lot from that brand. The Esther button up front knot, and then it cuts off. $39, so this is the cheapest thing in the box. So the total for all five items, which is two sweaters, one more lightweight than the other one, two tops that are short sleeve, good for transitioning, and a cardigan. The total is $266. If you buy all, get the 25% discount, take $66.50 off, making the total before taxes. And because I didn't have a styling fee, we don't have to take that $20 off, $199.50. So let's just think about it. So the first sweater, the pink sweater, was itchy. So I can't have that. I can't have a material that's itchy on me. And I really liked the Daniel Rain top but if I'm not getting them all, it's going to be $58. And I have a top similar to that from H&M that was $12. So I think I'm going to pass on the Daniel Rain navy top, even though I really like that top. And then the cardigan, the white cardigan, I'm going to pass on for sure. Because, I mean, it was a good one and it fit okay. But I think I can get a cardigan if I want a white cardigan, very similar at Walmart. For $11 or $12 now, I think they are. I can even get a Barefoot Dreams one for about $60 off QVC when they go on sale. So, I'm passing on the cardigan. Oh, and then the sweater that had the really pretty open stitch detail on the sleeves. That one is $49. So, that one's not a bad price for that one. But I just got to figure out, am I going to wear that that much because of the fact that it is a little bit more form-fitting? And then this one, of course, I'm passing on because I don't like that knotted detail. So it looks like she did a good job. This is no fault of her own, but just with, I guess, the pricing and the things that I could get that would be very comparable to it, I'm going to pass on all of these items. So it looks like this is going to be a zero for five box, even though my last box was a five for five. But hopefully, maybe when I check out, they'll offer me the free styling pass again and I'll get another back to back box and we'll see if it does better. But I had Jasmine again. This will be the second box she did. And again, the, the fact that this is a zero for five is not her fault. I think she really gave me what I asked for. So I'm going to keep her as a stylist. What did you think, guys? So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Also, I would love to have you consider hitting that subscribe button. I do weekly videos on fashion, beauty, and lifestyle. I hope to see you in my next video. And until then, I hope you have a wonderful day.